Hello, my most amazing artists, and happy last day of school. We are here to tell you about three things. First, we're going to share some funny jokes about summer and the end of school. Mm -hmm. Second, we're going to show you some art that we've made this week together. And then third, I'm going to show you some new additions to the Art at Home website yes. with things that you can do all mm -hmm. summer long. So let's start with some jokes. Go ahead, Declan. What do you get when what do you you get when you combine an elephant with a fish? I, I don't, don't know. know. Swimming trunks. Oh, brother. Mama, look what she's doing. She's saying awesome. Okay, next joke. And you can explain it too if ah. you want. Well, they already know what that means. Oh, okay. Why did the robot go on summer vacation? Hmm, why did the robot go on summer vacation? To recharge his batteries. Get it? Batteries? I don't get it. Because robots have batteries. And yeah, when you recharge your batteries, you're on vacation and you're like oh, relaxing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Very funny. Okay. Um, why don't mummies go on summer vacation? I don't know. They're afraid to relax and unwind. Get it? On go yeah, because um, cause I unwind like means go outside, like go on their vacation because they're too scared. They won't, don't want to unwind. They're, yeah. Yeah. They're, 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 they're mummy they're, wrapping. Like, yeah. like they're packing something, like, but they're wrapping up their things. Yeah. Okay, and the last joke. What? school do kids like to go during the summer? I don't know. Sunday school because of all the ice cream. Get it? Ice cream Sunday? <laughs> yeah. That's great. Okay, so we're going to show you some of the art that we've made this week. So Declan, why don't you start? I, I draw Bowser from Art for Kids Hub and then I paint it. Beautiful. Now, Aubrey, why don't you show this one? Declan, you've showed this, okay. and I'll show this. I made this ice cream cone. Oh, I put a pigeon and then an uh, ant carrying a rock on the side. And this is called a raised salt painting. I saw it too. It wanted to be in the video. We, we let a fly in our house. Oh, geez. Yes, so this is called a raised salt painting, and I'm going to link below this video the link to this art lesson. It's really fun. All That's, you need is liquid glue, salt, uh, and watercolor. This liquid is a glue. Kitty. Okay. And up here is something I need, and these are all things that make Yes. Yeah, and I'm going to put a... Um, and I just did an abstract one, but you draw it with glue, cover it with salt, and then you kind of drip watercolor, and it, it kind of flows and mixes all together. It was really fun. Very yeah. messy, though. Put down newspaper ahead of time. FYI. All right. And then lastly, go ahead. You can share these. Go ahead, no, I'm gonna, This is something that we made that we saw. But I did my different colors, like a rainbow, but that can just brown and peach. Yeah. And, and it's like, is, and it's um about um like, like us and the other people who are being treated fairly get the chance to vote and get equal rights. Equal rights. And do you know what? Mommy made this, but I'm just holding it up. Yes, I did a little abstract painting I while know the that. kids... I saw, I saw you already finished it. Yes. It's really good now. Thanks. Wow. Just lines and shapes, people. All right, so now I'm going to show you the changes to the Art at Home website so that you can visit it all summer yes. long. Stay tuned. All Bye. right. So you're going to go to this Art at Home website, and you'll see up at the top, I have a couple of new pages that I've added. So you've got Home... And under home, you've got all the techniques, which you can also visit here. You've got the techniques, drawing, painting, printing, fibers, 3D. But then here it says summer art resources. And here I have some articles with really fun outdoor activities that you can do. Um, 
that I looked through and I thought that they're really nice and I think parents might like them too. So that's the summer art resource page. Next to that, you'll see a new page called digital art. If you click on that, you will see um, these different sites that are interactive virtual art. I've, re I've played around with them all. They all work well. I think only two of them need flash. And if you don't have that on your computer, you wouldn't be able to use it. Um, but many of them don't. So this, um, I'm just gonna show you two of them. Bomomo, Bomomo, okay. Not sure why I spelled that, but it was fun to say. You like just move around your cursor and you can click these different options below and it's just super fun and you can create really neat designs and then you can save it and you can print it or you don't have to print it. I thought that was fun. Uh, if we go back, this toy theater has so many different interactive activities. Um, the street art one is really fun. I was going to show you this really quick. Um, you can have different size rollers. You've got spray cans. So you can make a background down here. You can choose different colors. The spray cans have different sizes and again, different colors. And you can save and print those as well. So that's pretty cool. Um, last but not least, if you go above or uh, right here where we have everything listed, Art Sites, which was there before, just shows some of my favorite sites. And then next to that is new diversity and art. So this celebrates artists of all different backgrounds, um, different artists from around the world, and then how to make art in their style. So you might want to check that out. This video with the holding hands that Declan and Aubrey did um, is on there as well. Okay, so just wanted to show you that. And if you ever want to get to my website, it's mrsvoigt.com. Or if you go to the Art Teacher Websites tab and you just click on my face or my little tag there, it will take you to my website, okay? I hope you have a wonderful summer. I know it's been a tough year, but you've all done so great. I'm so proud of you. I'll miss you very much, but I know we will see each other again soon. All right, bye everybody.